Have you ever thought about what it takes to shatter the barriers that society places before us? Meet Claudia L. Gordon, a woman who has dedicated her life to breaking barriers and creating opportunities. She stands as the first deaf black female attorney in the United States, a beacon of resilience and determination. Today, she continues to break barriers as a senior accessibility strategy partner at T-Mobile, working tirelessly within its diversity, equity, and inclusion team. But her journey of breaking the glass ceiling doesn't end there. She also held a unique position in the White House Office of Public Engagement, advising on disability issues. This significant role made her the first deaf person to work at the White House in a detail -y capacity. Each accomplishment, a testament to her unyielding spirit. But to appreciate the magnitude of these accomplishments, we must journey back to her beginnings. Born in Jamaica in 1972, Claudia's life took an unexpected turn at the age of eight. A sudden loss of hearing left her in a world of silence, a challenge that was met with a range of reactions, from sympathy to disbelief. As the medical community failed to diagnose her condition and traditional healers proved unhelpful, Claudia's family was left with no choice but to pull her out of school. For nearly two years, Claudia was confined to her home, left to manage household chores while her peers continued their education. The tides changed when Claudia emigrated to the United States, reuniting with her mother in the South Bronx. This transition marked a new chapter in her life, one that promised opportunities and a fresh start. However, it was her entrance into a new educational environment that would set the stage for her future success. At 11, Claudia's world expanded when she entered the Lexington School and Center for the Deaf in New York. Here, Claudia discovered a profound love for learning, mastering sign language, and rising to the top of her class. She didn't just excel academically, she also thrived in sports, student organizations, and community activities. One activity that notably shaped Claudia's future was the mock trial sponsored by the American Bar Association. For three consecutive years, Claudia made her mark as a member of the only deaf mock trial team in New York, and the only deaf high school team to ever win the competition. This experience sparked a fire in Claudia. The discrimination she'd experienced in Jamaica became a catalyst, fueling her determination to become a lawyer. She announced her intentions in her junior year of high school, boldly dismissing those who doubted her ability to succeed due to her deafness. In 1995, she graduated with honors from Howard University, earning a Bachelor of Arts degree in political science and securing a spot in prestigious honor societies and fellowships. But Claudia wasn't done breaking barriers. In 2000, she became the first deaf student to graduate from the American University, Washington College of Law. She was one of only around 50 qualified deaf lawyers in the U.S. and Canada at that time. With her education complete, Claudia was ready to make her mark in the world. With law degree in hand, Claudia embarked on a career that would see her break barriers and redefine norms. She began her professional journey with a prestigious two-year fellowship at the Skadden Fellowship Foundation. This marked the start of an illustrious career characterized by a series of firsts. Transitioning into the public sector, Claudia seized opportunities to affect change on a broader scale. Her most notable role, as the Associate Director in the White House Office of Public Engagement, was a testament to her relentless ambition. Her responsibilities were far from ordinary. She advised White House offices and senior officials, including former President Barack Obama, on disability issues. This political appointment was a groundbreaking moment as Claudia became the first deaf person to work at the White House in a detailee capacity. Claudia's journey didn't stop there. Today, she continues her mission at T-Mobile as a senior accessibility strategy partner, focusing on diversity, equity, and inclusion. Her work is a powerful reminder of the significant strides made in creating a more inclusive society, but also of the work that remains to be done. Claudia L. Gordon's story serves as a beacon of resilience, proving that barriers are there to be broken and that adversity in any form can be overcome.